What's up, everyone? My name's Chris Lou. Uh, welcome back to Five Nights with the. Uh, or not Five Nights at the Mac tonight. I just had that in my head. Five Nights at Treasure Island to the Lost Ones. Two. Uh, as you can tell by the corner there, that this is version two. Uh, the first one was, I guess, there was like he, he had to fix some um, character movement that was shifting through the rooms. It's been a while since I've really talked to him. I've been super busy. Um, but I didn't even get past night one. <laughs> so. Um, also, I've got to do the voice recording for this. Um, one more thing. Uh, my game, Dream of Mayweather, is currently playable on GameJolt. Go to it, download it, give it a comment, rate. Uh, let's try to get this thing for best dialogue and best storyline. If we don't get it, oh well. We did our best. Uh, another thing, there's going to be some big news regarding Salvation and Corruption coming soon. I'm going to be making an entire video of that, and I've been putting a lot of effort into that. And I really think you guys are going to like that. So be sure to go to that on Game Jolt, which I'm going to put in the description as well. So check that out and keep it up, keep up to date with that. I think a lot of you RPG fans are really going to like that one. So before we, without any ado, let's go to continue. See what that does for me. Night one, current time. Oh, I have yet to do the uh, voice recording for the rest of the nights. It's been a little bit hectic for me the past couple days. Well, not hectic. I've just been busy. My cat, he likes to yell. Yes, I eat ice. That's creepy. Because he's sparkly. Like, he's creepy looking, but all the glitter just takes completely away from it. Alright, so I don't remember any of the controls. So, current objective, get out of bed. So let's hit W, because that's what happened last time. Shift to hide, left click to move here. Control to toggle the flashlight, okay? P to answer the phone. So let's go ahead and listen to myself. Hello. I guess you were thinking that it would be this easy, no? I had no I idea it was going to be this easy. This. All right, here off. We don't need to hear you anymore. You don't seem to understand this. Okay, so he did leave the buttons for everything, okay. For the ritual to be completed, we need to have you participate. How do I shut myself off? We need all six of us. Fuck. Yes. Fuck. I have to listen to Nero talking the whole time. If you see him, don't try to run away unless okay. you're in a hallway. I'm assuming him is the gooey guy. Find a place to hide and listen for him to leave. If you see her... I'm assuming knife head. Don't move. Turn off any lights. Wait until she disappears. Okay. She doesn't like light anymore, you know. Not after what she's been through. Really gotta change the lighting in this area because I can see myself in the screen. I would so recommend much. not standing still for too long. They might find you in the So shift hides. Okay, so this you is much better in terms of being able to see. You are but I, I like that the scary inky blackness is part of the ambiance. There is no way out of this now. And if you don't want to... So there's no hiding in this hallway. Easy as that. I'll be back. Hey, hello. So I heard knocking, distinctive knocking. I did hear knocking, or I might, have, might not have been knocking. It might have been... I turn off the light. Did he move? I think he's gone. Awesome. So that did work. Okay, cool. What's in here? As I wonder quietly to myself. So I'm not seeing anybody. I like the creepy breathing mess. Considering I'm asthmatic. I know exactly what that feels like. Oh. Don't move. Okay, cool. She's gone. Awesome. Okay, cool. So we're getting the hang of this. We're doing a lot better now. 
All right, all right. Okay, so nobody's in. So nobody's there. I'm not hearing any knocks. Okay, let's see what's back here. Our, our girly friend. Listen for her to move. Okay, so she's gone. Cool. Cool. I think. Or maybe I just went back in the map. No, I didn't go back in the map. Awesome. So we're doing a lot better than we did before. Fantastic. So with the guy, we just gotta run into a hallway or something and do some... Don't like that. So nobody's there. I like how you can move the flashlight around. I was so giddy on uh, Discord. Whenever I saw that they had made this, that not they, but Mickey had made this into a free roam. I was so excited because it changed the entire game, like, a whole lot. Alright, so now I'm only going into one hallway, it seems, because I guess I'm stupid. Um, turning around in the hallway. Oh, crap. Can I hide? Can I hide? Nope. Ah, shit. They're gonna... I got cornered. Fuck that. I got cornered. Fuck. God, one was there, then the other was there. Turn off my flashlight. Can't fucking see shit. Alright. Alright. Just do that again. One more time. I'm pretty good on time. Ugh. Ah, oh, it's cold. Word to the wise. Careful with your teeth when you're... Oh, careful with cold stuff when your teeth are sensitive. Because it hurts. Alright. One more go. Okay. You would be everywhere, wouldn't you? Now, from what I saw on Discord, he's on, like, a couple other nights, Oswald. Which, if you've seen my previous videos of, uh... The other, the other five nights at Treasure Island where Oswald was moving around on night one, when I'm pretty sure he wasn't supposed to... Let's get up. Um, let's try to get back to the feel of the map again of where to move around, because I got kind of confused... Okay, there we go. Okay, so I don't want to answer the phone. Survive till daybreak. I'm just going to listen to myself, I guess. Okay, guess not. Okay, so this... So that, that way goes, takes me to my room. So I'm going to go out here. Let's go here. So that takes me back to the room. Um, going that way turns me around. All right, that's exactly what I was doing. So going down here turns me around, or goes goes backwards. This turns me. Around. I'll figure it out later. Okay, so okay. Tinkering with the flashlight. Probably not the best thing to do in a horror scenario. To tinker with a flashlight. I will admit again, I did like the con- I not did, but I still do like the concept of a free roam style Five Nights game, or even a free roam horror game for that matter. Where's the hiding spot here? Where am I? Am I in the bathroom? What, what am I hiding under? I don't know. I don't know what the fuck room this is. Oh, this is, looks like a kitchen or something. go this way, and it turns me around. No, it doesn't. Um, okay, I think this way will not turn me around, so this will... That will turn me around. Okay, so this way takes me... turns me... Good. Spooky little... Like, he did a very good job with the uh, steps. The ooky spooky steps. Now, now, little quick question regarding this game. No offense to anybody involved, myself included. What is the story behind it? I might just be being completely and totally stupid and ignorant. But maybe I'm just not for fuck. Fuck. So I'm 
hiding what happens if I get up okay so he's not in here yet god I've got to clean my screen off oh hi Spooky. Very spooky. Nothing. Okay, so he's just got to move. He's got to hurry up and move. I don't know what holding still really does. Like, so you have gone. Awesome. So you're gone. Fantabulous. Question is, where are you? Okay, it's very dark and spooky. Do I turn around? Oh shit, go. Hide. Is he gonna get me? Okay, he's not in here. Nobody seems to be in here. And hi, hi, hi. Saw your eyes. It's the only way I can see you anymore. I can see any of these people now. Let's go this way. This shows me no one and no thing. Let's go in this door here. Oh, shit. I'm gonna make sure if he doesn't stay in here too long. So he is gone. Yay. Okay, so I just go somewhere, hide, and he goes away. Pretty good, pretty simple, pretty easy. So, no, okay, I was just in there. So let's go through this door. Oh, shit. Hide. God, this breathing is just so reminiscent of everything. Mainly because of the fact I'm asthmatic. Oh, shit. Hide, motherfucker. Turn on your light. Turn off your light. <laughs> Damn, these guys are jumpy. Let's go bouncy, bouncy, bouncy from all the little areas of the room. And nothing, I don't think. Okay. Uh, nobody's around. Oh, shit. God, he is everywhere! He is. He is fucking everywhere, dude. Like, every five seconds, I turn around and the fucker's right there. Well, I haven't seen She-Bitch in a while. That means doesn't mean she's not there. It just means she's not visible. He's gone. She's gone. That was that was that was awkwardly specific and special timing. Well, not necessarily special. Just oh shit. Get in there and hide, because that's what you need to run and hide. Six should be coming up any second now. Six o'clock. Come on. Nobody's in this room, so I guess I can camp here for a little bit? Maybe? And hope to survive? I see nobodies. Lots of nobodies. Plenty of somebodies. Hide. Lots of somebodies all up in here. Turn off the light. Come on, turn over to six. You're right there. Unless he makes it go to seven. And there's a problem. Can I do it this time? Turn over. Hurry up. Thank the gods. Okay. 
We finally figured it all out. Fuck yeah! Anything special storyline or anything? I'm curious. Or let's just go straight to the menu screen. Let's go straight to the menu screen. Okay. Now, I'm hoping he releases some story behind it, because that'll be awesome. He's probably sent me Skype messages and Discord, and I just haven't looked at them. Anyway. Night 2. Five Nights at Treasure Island 2, The Lost Ones. Or Five Nights at Treasure Island, The Lost Ones 2. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. <coughs> Very energetic night. Anyway, going on from this. A uh, link to this game is going to be in the description. I'm pretty sure it's out now. I'm not happy yet. But I'm pretty sure it's out at this point. Um, go ahead and, if it's not out, uh, follow the page, follow the game, keep up to date with it. It's actually pretty cool. It's a free roam version of the Treasure Island series, which I like. And he's sort of taken his own unique twist on it, as you can tell by what the hell we're looking at right now. So, yes, link to this game is going to be in the description, as well as the National Alliance on Mental Illness. Support them any way you can, and the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline. My games, Dream of Mayweather, and the current, current, I say current because there's going to be a whole lot changing, The Salvation and Corruption, the page for that is going to be in the description as well. Be sure to go to that and follow and keep up to date. Download the demo if you want. The engine it's being used on is no longer valid. We're going to be switched over to the VX engine. There's going to be a lot of changes with that. A lot of good changes. Also, I've got a secret project I'll be releasing soon, which is very Lovecraftian, if anybody knows what that is. Keep an eye out for that, too. Um, be sure to comment, like, comment, subscribe, follow, whatever you guys do on Instagram, which I think you'll be there, too. Sorry, it's been a long day for me. Um, if you guys got any horror games you want me to do, or any other games you want me to do, horror games or otherwise, I'll see you guys later.